Welcome back to the Crazy Josh Cravies. I'm Josh Cravey, and these are three quick tips for filming movies. Number one, you don't always need the clearest shot. Take this shot, for example. I wanted a clean shot of the counter with just the blender and the toast drawn on it, but it wasn't clean. It had a sink on the side when it was pretty clustered. No worries, I just moved the blender out of the way grabbed a bit of that footage, flipped it around, and there you go, a nice clean shot. You don't always need a perfectly clear shot. You can improvise in editing. Number two, the nice handheld look. We all love that handheld look in movies and dramas, but did you know it's actually a lot easier to get than you thought? In fact, you don't even need to shoot a single shot in your entire movie moving. Before or after filming, it doesn't really matter when, just grab your camera and point it at something. You want to hold the camera with your hands and then just get a clear shot of some identifiable object. A dot usually works. For this shot, I put two dots on my cabinet and filmed that holding the camera. Then once you're in your editing software, simply motion track the dots and apply it to your footage. My editing program only motion tracks one, but that's fine, it'll work just as well. If your footage becomes messed up, you can simply use a transform or an extra motion effect to shift your clip back into place. Remember to zoom in a little bit so you don't get black bars on the side. And number three, color correcting. One of the worst things you can do is to film a shot that takes place at night, at night. This almost never works because the lighting is way off and you can hardly see a thing. So you can film your movie completely out of order with color correcting, just level out all the clips to make it look like it was shot in the same time. And of course you want to darken, add some blue, and desaturate the clips that take place at night, and there you go, a night shot taken during the day. And those were three quick tips for filming movies. In movie news, for myself, my short film is having some more filming delays, so it will have to be pushed back to July, but no worries. I'm sure it'll still turn out great. Also, you can expect a movie review every single day next week. Anyway, like I said before, I'm Josh Cravey, and that's about it. So until next time, I bid you all goodbye.